Hey guys, welcome to Mom Can Never Know the Dollar. Today we're playing Metal Slug, and we got two guests on the show from Instant Replay Live. Yeah. Go ahead and say hello to the fellas. We're Rush from, off the boat all the way from the internet. <laughs> We've traveled many data streams to get here. Yeah, God, how was the trip? I heard it was a real shit show getting in. The it sea of packets was, of course, a disaster. <laughs> uh, yeah, fucking I'm amazed you survived. This time of year, it's tumultuous. All the porn. <laughs> well, 4chan was a real blessing. God what? damn. I've yes. never heard that before. <laughs> I don't think anyone's ever heard that exact sentence before. Well, it's kind of like, so if you can imagine, like, you're trying to lose people who are tracking you, right? So you're like, I'm going to go into this pirate city or this, you know, like, black market or whatever. <laughs> Were we being tracked to Trouble Planet? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Um, and so <laughs> we, we lost them in 4chan because, you know, of course... Everything's yeah, going to go gotta down careful. there, and, and they got like, oh no, you know, the agents, they got the, caught up by... The fucking, all, yeah, all the FBI guys like, hold on, I gotta read this <laughs> anime porn for a second, it's just too good to pass up. <laughs> guys, so you gotta be ticks. careful when it comes to our show, because uh, we do have a lot of ties to uh, shady government uh, companies and stuff like that. That makes Goddamn sense. Goddamn, the fucking, yeah, we're, 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 we're part of the government's little known <laughs> uh, anime porn cataloging department. Yep. We keep track of all the hentai... <laughs> So anyway, uh, <laughs> log it. So anyway, so we got Nick and Joe from Instant Replay Live. So go ahead and tell us a little bit about what you guys do. What are you guys? What are you guys all about? What do you? So what, I mean, we're we're kind of like you guys, but without a unifying theme. We, oh yeah. We uh, we play video games and we chat over them about similarly random nonsense topics. Um, gotcha. And who's uh, playing by the way on your side? We just don't have. Um, like an arcade theme to bind us or like any limits on when we'll play a game or not play a game. Right. And, oh, and yeah. we're we're bound and gagged by our theme. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you never you never break it or anything, right? If you catch <laughs> if you catch my drift. Actually my very first suggestion this session was let's play a Genesis game. Oh, <laughs> and nice. I was like, no, it won't be the same. <laughs> yeah. Well, because it's always it's always difficult trying to like imagine like what is it people watch this show for? Do they watch it for us, or are they watching it because they're like, I want to see arcade games that I grew up with. <laughs> and I, I mean, promptly say that's the conceited view <laughs> that we kind of went for was that like we're trying to sell ourselves, which is yeah, yeah. Cause no right, one knows like, us. Yeah. It sounds vaguely God, prostitutional. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. I haven't tried to sell myself since Guam. <laughs> we are just wrecking house in this game. This is like the first time I've ever played this game. All those fucking Japanese that. businessmen. Two oh, LT Joe Star. Ah. Yeah, I, I, uh, I fucked up bad. What'd you do? Who's playing on your side, by the way? Uh, so I'm not, Nick. I'm playing, and I uh, I've not already used bad, Nick. one credit. <laughs> <laughs> the Nick we have imploded in on himself like the house at the end of Poltergeist when I beat his top score at Snacks and Jackson. <laughs> you'll uh, you'll find out more about that later. Don't Dude, you worry. I love yeah. that knife action. Yeah. Oh, that's one of the great themes of this game. Actually, is that like you're more powerful with a knife than you are with uh, with any kind oh, of shit. ranged weapon. I you thought you'd watch out for them laser beams. I, I, got, I got nervous. What? I didn't think I could make the jump. What other game is it where you just have an, uh, a melee attack that's better than everything? Fucking... Uh, uh, Counter-Strike. Maybe. Uh, Halo. Well, oh, yeah, Halo, any modern shooter. For sure. <laughs> yeah, pretty much every game. No, I never get my fucking melee shit to work in Battlefield, although I do love Battlefield. Can't get enough of that that's Battlefield 4. I haven't I played that one yet. Soon. That's only console, right? Destiny? <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, I refuse not? to play Destiny. No, it's console it's only. It's an exclusive, yeah. I believe. Yeah, I, uh, I converted to PCism yeah. some moons ago, and now I'm a big elitist cocksucker. Well, yeah. I, don't get me wrong. PC is definitely the best. The master race for a reason. I, but there are games <laughs> that you could only get on certain consoles. And yeah. And that's the reason that's, I, I go for I'm PS4. On the, yeah, I'm on the verge of getting a Wii U actually, because I've been eyeballing Mario Maker and Splatoon for some time now. Like, I actually refused to get a uh, like that's Destiny on principle because when I was living in Maryland, all three of my roommates went out and bought PS4s at the same time just to play Destiny, and then they would not shut the fuck up about it. And like, dude, Kyle, Kyle, get get, get Destiny. Ah, uh, I hate Destiny. when that happens when all your roommates get some fucking system and they want you to get the system and they yeah. won't shut up about it. My roommates got a PS Vita like the day it came out. Ugh. I'm like, there's no games die? out on it. Fuck. I'm play. I don't wanna fucking yeah, God damn died. it. I mean, Ugh. we're all gonna die eventually. I mean, yeah. I, universe, I mean, it Kyle, how did you deal with your problem? Because I dealt with it in a very unique way and it never came up again. What problem? The 
roommates never shutting up about their new system. I would just say, I'm not getting a fucking PS4, and then they would never shut up about it, and I just moved out eventually. I, yeah, I think I was going to say, that's the only real resolution, is get rid of your roommates. My solution yeah. was having roommates that just played D&D &D instead. Oh, that's uh, good. That's, cool. that's possible, but these weren't those kinds of nerds. There's different species of I'm, nerds. Everyone's that kind of nerd, they just don't realize it. Yeah. Well, the, these were the gigabytes kind of nerds, you know? Like, hey, you got the most gigabytes. Oh, shit. Here's how I did it. We might have to bleep this little story out, Kyle. Get ready. <laughs> because here's oh, why I made them never talk like, about the Vita again. Because I was like, they're like, oh, the Vita. It's like the 800th time that day they brought it up. They're like, oh, the Vita, man. You can watch movies and stuff on it. You can watch TV. and all the I'm like, okay. I can, can I watch uh, the latest series that I want to see? It's, it, it's like, yeah, yeah. What, what's it called? It's like, uh, it's called Cunt. Starring Drew Carey. Oh, my God. Oh, my <laughs> like, God. Well, uh, we were in a restaurant a really at the time. Good series, like, though. Can you just bleep <laughs> both... us from the entire? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> they both, they both stared in utter shock. Like, God, did you really say that? We were in like a Chili's or something too. I'm like, but like after a few oh seconds of dead silence, I was just like, what? You guys don't like Drew Carey? Oh my God. <laughs> and no, they never the bothered me about the either. PS Vita again. You know, I love that. I love that whole story because I relate to that story. I used to, do, <laughs> I used to really try to offend my friends in Walmart. Yeah. You know, I, I don't have any real angry Friends. feelings about anybody. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna have to, I, I just loved, like, pushing people's buttons to see how uncomfortable they could get with bad jokes. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know what? Why isn't there a video game where, like, it's literally, like, okay, the bad guys are coming, and, like, you have to sit in this level area for, like, 25 minutes before anything actually happens, and then, like, the good guys come in, and then you have... Like, 12 seconds to actually fight them, and then they I just mean, beat your ass and you just Kyle, this design doc sounds atrocious. <laughs> I'm, uh, into like every, I'm into it. There it are games, a, though, like uh, Dungeon Keeper and stuff like that, where you're, like, the dungeon boss. Or, no, no, no. Uh, I mean, like, you're just one of these random mobs in a video game. Oh, okay. Like, uh, <laughs> I'm pretty... Oh, I see. I pre I'm pretty sure someone's done something like that. It could be, it could be a Steam Greenlight game, and it's an indie game. That, it definitely like, sounds like the, the, the caliber of Greenlight games I've seen. Right. <laughs> yeah, right. Why don't you get your ass on Kickstarter, Kyle, with that fucking swell idea? I would like to say real quick, though, before we move on from everything, uh, thanks a lot, Keith, for uh, silencing our, uh, <laughs> our fucking first guest stars ever with just stunned silence. You're welcome. <laughs> That's well, what I bring to the table, <laughs> motherfucker. I'll have you cocksuckers know you didn't silence this... Yeah. Oh my God! Please God stop. Damn. See, look at that, Kyle. You dared him. You dared him. You dared him to, to the wills are mocked. Dared to get Jewish on the internet. Good God! Oh my God! What is happening? I this don't is... associate with what's happening here. It's Women Joe, every... are the servants of the Lord in the kitchen. Is Joe every single person I've ever played Battlefield Online with? Yes. <laughs> you cocksucking noobs need to learn to play. Oh, wait, wait. I recognize that cadence. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Teabagger69. Teabagger69. <laughs> Fucking... I need that name inside ah. me. Inside oh, God. <laughs> You're not okay. supposed to like it. It's supposed to be a bad name. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> Fucking. What's what? happening? I'm like, I'm having an existential crisis. I'm like, I'm trying to. Trying to be bad and it's fucking not working. <laughs> so that was always my response to people who were like being a dick to me for whatever reason they had. I would always agree with them, like enthusiastically. Mm. If someone ever like, like said they slept with my mom or something, I'd be like, oh, that's great, you know, she's lonely. Thanks, you know, take care of her. <laughs> yeah. right, and, right. you know, eventually they just give up. It's, uh, yeah. it's yeah. a really good defense. Yeah. I agree oh, with God. that. To make you some enemies on Wall Street, though. <laughs> I'm not even sure. I'm not quite sure what I mean by that, I but died. it stands. Oh my god! Hey, Kyle, are we breaking for the time or what? Uh, yeah, we'll break in a, in a second. It's ten minutes, man. What are you fucking? <laughs> yeah. All right. So, what kind of uh, amateur shit show is this? Yeah, fucking Kyle. So with that, go ahead and join us on the next episode of Mom Can Even Know the Dollar. We'll continue to play Metal Slug with Instant Replay Live. Next I'll time we're on back. white people time. <laughs> we're all we're all on that time all the time. Hey, it's Nick from IRL. Huge thanks to the Trouble Planet guys for having us on. It was an incredibly fun time. If you're not familiar with IRL, pop on over to our channel. There should probably be an annotation here somewhere. We even had the Mom Can I Have Another Dollar guys come over and play some Broforce with us. So if you want more of this kind of content, it's available and ready right now. Go ahead. Give it a click.